Let's go, Regina! Woo-hoo! Actually, quite a hard matchup for Ken. Oh, yeah, Ken gets, gets zoned really easily. Also, Snake has a bunch of multi hits that are going to be focus. Yeah, like down air. Um, what, what the strength this year is that Ken is heavy like Snake. Actually, Snake doesn't have that many quick down air or quick um, focus beating moves. There's down air. F tilt is the big one. There as well. F tilt and jab. Yeah, F tilt F -tilt and jab. F tilt and jab. And, I and you like can land down, down air. Yeah, down air. But when you're on the ground, Jab or F tilt will work. Yeah, definitely F tilt. Jab, jab and F tilt are very similar. F tilt is just a little slower. Than Snake gets a lot of off ground. Look at this, and he's just he's just he's platform camping on PS2, just by full hopping in grenades. Yeah. Oh, that's a big punish. Wow. wow. He's not dead though. Yeah. Not, yeah Rilo he, does know how to. Rilo jab. definitely knows how to be honest. He is, he's not one to drop sets to Corvo, and then up tilt not going to take it. Wow. Close. Broken close. I'm actually impressed with it. I have no idea. It says um, the white fox took one more stock than actually I don't know the one. Looks like just one. I mean, when I say Jess, I mean Michael. I know you do. Jess! Jess! I think he hears. He only listens to melee players. Jess! I'm a melee player. Get it, guys? I enter the weekly in melee. I almost beat someone that time. Oh, he's stuck. The winner of Melee Fantasy. Thumbs and Decree's time. Woo! <laughs> Let's go thumbs at work. I put the CD in as a top eight, and it won. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go, Regina. Yes. Wait, who won Melee? Joe. Joe. See you in yeah. Pongo canceling that focus, I, yeah. I think that's like a smart move. Oh, that's big. You don't want Ken uh, in the corner. Yeah. Or like, Ken doesn't want to be in the corner. Oh. And he's going to get some grenades down. Yeah, there's one. He's just juggling up with uppers. At this mid-range, it's very scary for both players. Yeah. Especially Snake. Especially Snake. Because if, if Snake goes in, he can get an up tilt really quick. But if Ken goes in, he can get everything. Everything, yeah. Oh no! An up tilt, maybe. I think F tilt would have probably been a better option. Yeah, I think F tilt, F smash, down smash, I think would have been his best. I think down, maybe a down back throw? No, definitely. Alright, let's go, Regina! Yeah, there we go! Solo comms for just a second. 
Um, I just want to talk about um, how Snake plays against Ken in terms of positioning. So if Snake has a if Snake has a grenade in his hand and holding shield while he's close, Ken has to back away, which uh, is tough because Snake will zone you out when you back up, but you can't stay close and hold shield or Snake is gonna grab. So basically, you have to maintain a mid range at the whole game, yeah. and you have to watch out for stuff like dash attack, which is just an incredible burst option from yeah, Snake. Well, that's the and game. I think. I guess. Wow, that was big. Uh, Pong is going to more toxic in those four changes and capitalize on those big advantages. But for a read, doesn't quite pay out. Oh, is he going to die here? No, you SDI is not going to show you. Oh my god. He better just fall out due to straight luck. However, the, no, I feel like his positioning was almost perfect. I feel yeah. like he SDI'd out. Kills himself with a C4. Blows himself up. That's okay. You know, that's fine. Oh, that's oh, oh, that's some big damage. Oh, he went for a quick C4. Yeah, he keeps instant oh! It's kind of like hero double down beat. Yeah. Oh my gosh! That could be so big. It wasn't though. He dropped the C4. He's not leaving C4 out. I think he's just realizing that Pongo is very aware. I don't know if Pongo saw that. I did. I did. I did. Is that where he dropped the grenade and the C4 in the grenade? Yeah. I know. There, Pongo did what Rylan has been doing this whole game. He's holding on to that grenade. Slope double checking this whole I'm this whole yeah, ton, this right. whole Troy theory with the grenade. To get down tilts. Wow! That's just an oh immense God. read. Unbelievable read. Pongo might have had to leave after that one. Yeah. yeah unfortunately, it, it really like it would have worked in one half of the situation. Yeah. Is this good? Yeah. I think. See the freaking Troy blow the grenade on the ground. Yeah. That's, that's actually so huge that Ken can't show you when a grenade is around because he's gonna blow up the grenade and hit himself. He's gonna throw it eventually, so you just have to up him while, while he has it in his hand. Doesn't get the read on the down throw. Oh, and then up tilt's gonna take it. This is really even. If Regina can go up 2 0, this is big. Wow, and he's just going for some big C4s. And there you go, up tilt beating. Oh, this is the up there! Oh, this is huge. It's not consistent. Um, if Ken hits Snake from behind, it will blow up the grenade in his hand. But if he's hitting his Snake from in front, Snake will drop the grenade before the flames of the shore you hit him. Fun fact. Keep in mind... But a Snake, a grenade on the platform? What? Who did that? What you, it, this is... This is <laughs> oh. Just, just get rid of it. Yeah, sure you will blow up grenades in hand. Did you up this sword? I assume. Yeah. Zach, yeah, sure you will blow up grenades on the stage, doubles? not in no, hand. Keep in mind that Rylo is dropping just about every grenade right in front of him, and I think that's pretty good. Cool. He's just shield. He's just auto shield rubber. Does Ken have a flaming Hadouken? Or is that only Ryu? That's only Ryu. Only Ryu, okay. So I was going to say that could be huge. Which is why I think Ryu actually wins this matchup. Part, or, or does better than Ken. Yeah, I so, I, I'm, I'm not saying Ken wins this match in any no. capacity. This is so hard just because of how little positioning advantage you have. I feel Snake, like Ryu does way better than Ken. Snake wins the long range. Uh, doesn't really win the close but range. But I don't think Oh, that great anti air up tilt. Pongo, I don't think he has a Ryu. Unlike Locust, who plays Ryu mostly. I think Ryu does, yeah, way better in this matchup than Ken does. Just because he can flaming shore you or flaming Hadoken and a non-flaming shore you as well. Yeah. 
Yeah. Those are two things that definitely make this matchup a lot easier for yeah. you. He could, he could like, at least make an attempt in the long range game. Yeah. I honestly think Ryu could almost win the long range game. If he just spams. It'd be, it'd be tough. If he spams, like. Um, Imagine Ryu playing as his owner against the best owner in the game. Snake's not as his owner. Yeah, you're right. He's a whole other breed of character. He's yeah, a collateral exactly. damage character. Kamikaze. Yeah. How's he gonna get by that? Yeah. He just doesn't. He gets hit with the grenade. I love just playing this so well. Oh, wow. That's probably should go for a grab there. But probably should have, yeah. Yeah. I think he was scared of like a shorty who had a shield or something. Yeah. I don't think he did. He's supposed to be able to show you how to shoot. Oh! Genius double parry. Yeah, that was not an auto parry in any class. No, not at all. Auto parry can only be the same move for two different players' moves. Yeah. Oh, yeah, wow, there it is. There it right is there. Yeah. I told you. I labbed this. He has to go for medium Shoryu. Hippie oh, Shoryu will always blow the game. Oh, oh, oh. Pongo probably doesn't know that. No, no way. No way. It's so ridiculously Look, I, obscure. There's yeah. no way Rylo doesn't know this. Because the way he drops grenades right in front of him. I mean, or, that's just kind of how state oh, players play. Yeah, but the way he's always like standing right away from the grenade or putting it above him. Like he leaves grenades on platforms. I mean, he's definitely lot. noticed that like he's getting Shoryu and then not dying. Oh yeah, hundred percent noticed. But yeah, if uh, he gets Shoryu from the oh, behind, no. that was like that was a big, big kick. Oh, yeah, that'll do. Yeah, it's just no a grenade. raw. I think that was a raw. I'll be honest. Like, <laughs> Could have been. Yeah, these up tilts on ledge are covering a lot. Yeah. No punish. Oh, oh, oh he's getting over the down tilt. Oh, uh, wow. Catches him, though. I think he almost wanted to get hit by that side. Kind of for the Tatsu. But do. Oh, this is going to be our second 3 0 in winter semi. Yeah. Rilo's just making such a run. This is winners, though. That's so big. Wow. And that up going to catch him. A 3 0 for Rilo. Let's go, Regina.